This fourth phase disbursement of the DCARES Empowerment Package marks another significant milestone in the administration of Delta State Governor Sheriff Obore Wari. Representatives of over 97,000 beneficiaries dressed in their shirt attires are patiently seated, awaiting the arrival of the governor to begin the day's event. In their goodwill messages, the Commissioner for Economic Planning and the Chairman State Care Steering Committee, Mr. Sonny Ekedayan, as well as the member representing Oshimili South State Constituency in the State House of Assembly, Honorable Bridget Ayafulu, commend the Governor's initiative and also speak on how the beneficiaries were selected. Beneficiaries have so far benefited from this program, mainly through grants, livelihood support, improved rural infrastructure, and to mention but a few. You will agree with me that His Excellency deserves the applause and commendation of all the fans for scaling up the program to this time, at this time of severe economic crisis, generalized hardship, and large-scale impoverishment arising from the withdrawal of petrol subsidy and drastic fall in the value of the Naira cost by the decision. While urging beneficiaries to make good use of the opportunity to grow themselves and their businesses, the governor says the state government is set to roll out other empowerment programs through the different state government ministries. In the next few months from now, this amber month, outside this program, the youth, the commissioner for youth will roll out other programs. Science and Tech will roll out other programs. There are so many programs to touch the people. It's now time for the symbolic presentation of checks to beneficiaries with the governor, his deputy and the speaker of the State House of Assembly presenting checks and starter packs to beneficiary businesses, individuals and communities. The empowerment package cuts across six delivery platforms comprising state cash transfer units, labor intensive public workfare unit, livelihood support unit, community driven development social implementation unit, which brings the total beneficiaries on the fourth tranche to 97,365 and the overall total beneficiaries at 200,000.